Hey guys, this is your favorite fat man currently setting in the van at another uh, medical transport for dad. This one's in the evening. Uh, it's Thursday. Was going to go to the cruise in, Thursday night cruise in in Huber Heights, but I'm almost to Cincinnati. I don't think I can get back in time to cover that. And besides that, it's raining down here. Um, we'll see if it's raining as we go by. If it's not raining, I might ease by, but probably going to miss that one. Like I said earlier in a video, uh, family comes first, got to do it. Right now, mom's not in the condition to drive long distances anymore. She's good to go to the store, the corner store, the gas station and stuff, but um, not long distances. So we're trying to take care of that. And then still, they're only allowing uh, two people in so since it's their doctor they're both going in and of course I tried to give mom a list of things to talk about and everything but we'll see what happens I can always try and call and talk to the doctor which uh, my sister T used to do all the time that was her thing since she couldn't get down here um, used to call and talk to him or do the Skype FaceTime whatever time so I got uh, quite a few things to talk about so I probably should uh, stop rambling this is kind of going to be where I will be this weekend or attempt to be this weekend but there's also uh, something that's come up and um, at a lot of the shows and stuff people like to play the 50 50 do raffles do different stuff whatever and that money goes to to help the organizations and they could possibly win something either a, a, a type of a door prize or a type of a gift or a little something in rewards for whatever uh, the 50 50 theoretically you get half of whatever it goes goes whatever so that the promoters are helped out a little bit and possibly they're charities and or organizations in need are helped out so that's really good and uh, the car enthusiasts the uh, hot rodders the bikers those are some of the biggest people with the biggest hearts in the world and uh, I can attest to that uh, basically who raised me is <laughs> all the old bikers and military so uh, uh, I got something coming up and it's uh, gonna be called a uh, the mystery box uh, it'll basically be a gophers reward mystery box and I've talked to several of the promoters and they're into it. Um, what it's gonna be is the box will be things, um, we had to close our store uh, there in Midway. We had a novelty shop. Uh, uh, Mom had her sewing and repair, seamstress stuff. I had the computer, the volunteer service computer stuff, um, all of that uh, and everything. And because of the COVID and the illnesses, we've had to close it. There's just no way. Um, we have never in the 18 years that we've been doing this when we were in Springfield and then out here for seven um, we've never made a profit it, it's basically a community thing it was a community thing to for mom to do what she does I mean uh, regular places were charging 14 15 dollars to do what she was doing for five uh, when I was doing the computer service and stuff um, there were places that were $75 a half hour and I was five dollars an hour um, basically it was a donation of five dollars for me to come in and see what I could do and everything so we're not trying to make money we weren't trying to make money at that I'm not trying to make money at this what I'm trying to do is this is going to go in and I'm gonna split it up between the promoter whoever's running the show the DJ whoever and my gas fund so I'll have a box uh, the box will be packed full of stuff from the store uh, things for my advertisement merch my uh, my spam stuff um, anything that mom may have sewn, um, we have dog items, uh, coats, colors, uh, small children's backpacks, uh, carry-alls, purses, uh, some car items and stuff. We're going to get a box, pack it full of the stuff. It'll be a minimum of a $10 bid. And at that $10 bid, if somebody bids $10 and nobody else bids higher than that, they get the box and whatever's in it and the promoter gets that portion and I get of that portion and stuff so we split it up so it would be five and five um, like it is we're not trying to make money we're trying to do for just for an example uh, hot dogs probably going to use his to promote and go for his the money giveaways or the prize giveaways that he does on the wooden nickel uh, hot dog has one of the biggest hearts in the world those of you that know him know the reality of that has one of the biggest hearts in the world and it's always about him about giving and giving and giving um, that's why we didn't want him to retire because he is such a joy uh, cherished by all of us that follow him around 
Um, so we're going to do that. I, I don't know what you guys think about that. Like, again, we're not trying to sell something. I'm not trying to make money. I'm, I, what I'm trying to do is be able to get to the shows. And instead of um, you just getting the little gopher award and no one was getting anything to the promoters, um, I thought maybe this would help the promoters out and me out. So it's an idea. Um, it's already been a go from several of the places where I go. I can't guarantee I'll have a package ready every time because, like I said, family comes first and we are still trying to move stuff out. We only have a few more days before they just lock the doors and take everything else that's left in there. And uh, that would be a total really big loss. So this way we're getting stuff back out into the uh, community items that you may or may not use. If you get the box, you're the high bidder and you don't like the items, you can give them back. You can re-donate them back to, uh, to the promoter. You can do whatever you want to do with them. Um, but there'll be all kinds of things in there. So I can't say what it'll be. The majority of the stuff will be either new gently used uh, that we would have had in the retail and the, in the, the uh, 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 consignment shop or stuff that mom made that was new. Um, so we'll see what it is. Um, you can make gifts that way. Uh, a lot of ladies stuff, a lot of uh, probably possibly jewelry and like I said, clothing items and or purses and bags. So let me know what you think. That's what I'm gonna try and do. I'll try and make the box a decent size, minimum bid of $10. Um, you know, I don't foresee it going, you know, hundreds of dollars and stuff. That's not what the whole thing is about. But uh, anything over $10, a bit of $10, then we can give the box away. If nobody bids on it, I'll pack it up and take it to the next show and whatever. I'm not gonna know what's in the boxes after they're boxed up because they'll all probably be pretty much identical so it's the mystery box uh, is what it is i have no idea what's in them after we start putting stuff in them and seal them up um you could find anything from the secret of roswell the uh ufo landings to uh jimmy hoffa's watch or uh, maybe even something more uh, like king tut's toe i don't know it could be anything out there um and like i said it, it may or may not be um hot rod or automobile um you know related and stuff it's it's what we have so all right so this is the list of the places that i will try and be this weekend i know there's a lot of them but i'm not going to be able as i mentioned before i'm not going to be able to get to as many as i did last time that's nearly done me in and i'm actually still editing the monday night uh cruise in in new carl which was fantastic I appreciate everybody coming out. That was great. We are going to have bigger vendor trucks soon, uh, working on getting all that um, and, and everything. The video, uh, as you see it, um, I, I'm, I'm pressed on getting all the editing done, so it's more or less going to be a straight run and gun, raw video, raw sound. Uh, be prepared. There are adults present, and if they say whatever they say, like it or not me, like it or not you, it's going to probably be on the video uh, unless YouTube blocks it. So that's the what's going on. So here's the list of uh, where I'm going to try and be for this weekend. All righty. So Saturday, May 1st, the British Tea and Biscuits. That's 10 a.m. till noon, meeting at the parking lot across uh, east of Archie's and Kettering, 2100 East Dorothy Lane in Dayton cool time I like these cars so I go out when I'm asked also Saturday May 1st is the Kettering Saturday night cruise in Kettering Town Center on Dorothy Lane and Woodman from 5 till dark this is awesome if you've never been out get out there it is the place to be on Saturday night now on Sunday May 2nd it's Dick Hot Dog Ryman uh, at the Heart of Ohio Antique Center that's 4785 East National Road, Springfield, Ohio, and that goes from noon to 4. It's going to be a good time, and uh, I have a special request for the weather to be super nice. <laughs> Monday, May 3rd, Monday night cruise in in the parking lot off of 201 North Main Street, New Carlisle. It's Monday night cruise in New Carlisle, 5 p.m. until closing. Got lots of things planned. Be out there, guys. All right. So, as I said, the mystery box, uh, trying to get to those places, trying to get money for the gas fund, uh, 
Um, you know, the money, the gas went up in the, that truck and the gopher is going to be up on blocks for probably pretty much the summer till I get those parts either made or do some more research and try and find them someplace. I, I might get lucky and be able to find some in New Jersey and in uh, New York, uh, Boston, um, a couple other places, uh, Myrtle Beach and the Carolinas where this one came from. They still use those vehicles, but they're using the newer ones. Maybe if they had some of the older ones, I could make a deal with somebody that had some of the older ones and actually get the uh, bearings, bearing shafts and, and all of that stuff at a really decent price. Problem is shipping of something that size is costly. That's why I can't uh, ship out a lot of my larger merch, the, the large cones and the coffee cups and stuff. It, it, it would cost 10 times to ship it, you know, than what I could get to, to re so it's all a money thing as far as being lost. Uh, I don't mind giving. I love to give. That's what I want to do. But it can't be a total loss then because then I can't go to the shows. So, <laughs> and the, the whole idea is for me to get to the shows. So, all right, guys, uh, love you all. And I appreciate everything everybody's done. Um, I'm going to try and have some more of the stickers. Those seem to be going really well. So, uh, some of the stickers are more made up and stuff uh, as soon as I can come up with that. And uh, we'll get more of the coffee cups. They like the coffee cups. They're cool little cups. I mean, they work really well and stuff. And they don't always have to have coffee in it. Uh, as uh, some of the folks will tell you, an adult beverage works just fine in them. <laughs> Keeps it cool or warm, however you like it. <laughs> so uh, that's the deal. That's where we're going to be or try to be for this weekend. We'll see about the weather right now. It is nasty looking. So I'm waiting and then we'll get on the road and that's where I'll be. Thanks, guys. I really appreciate it. See ya! Damn, that was annoying.